What's up people, welcome back to City Skylines, my name is Durixis and today we're back at the train station. This is the area we worked on in the last episode and if we zoom out a bit you can see things have changed around here. I've now added a bus stop, right here is one and uh, we have spots for many more. I think we have places for, uh, or, or space for five more. This is a little cinematic bus stop, I like it, uh, it looks kind of cool. And behind this I have done a bit of work on the detailing. For example, we now have the Merca, which is, I think, some supermarket or something. I uh, like the building, actually. It's a default one. Looked really cool. And uh, I think I'm going to use this a bit more. I think there's the loading dock. We can put some trucks there, but I'm going to use this a bit more, I think. I like it. And next to that, we have a shopping center where we have some uh, some cool shops in there. Some beer, I think. I don't know. Also, we have the um, this the cinema. It says... Rondo, it's a Rondo cinema and uh, yeah it's cool like it and then I added some warehouses and some trucks and all that kind of stuff just to make it look a bit more filled in as you can see now this area is near completion and this is, is my masterpiece I've done a little uh, construction area it's not really construction but it's demolition demolition uh, we have some trailers here some trucks and some containers and then there's some uh, some cranes working on this building to take it down and stuff and some of these guys and here and some abandoned houses probably some sort of a fire went down here so that's why they're taking everything down uh, I like it I love the looks especially at night it looks kind of cool if we can make it night real quick I yeah, like that as you can see it's nice lit up and uh, with the sunset the city looks absolutely amazing it, uh, it's just, it's love. It's all love. I like it. Uh, I don't know about you, but uh, I think it's kind of cool what, what, what I've done here off screen. I also added more of these bridges to get to the other side. Traffic is building up here nicely. And uh, I think everything is being used. This is a bit less. It was lots of traffic on there, but now it is the center bridge. Uh, this is the center bridge city, to be honest. You got a road going there, here, there, there. It's just epic. Now, before I uh, get off to the topic... Uh, added a train station right here. It's not the finished process or progress right here. We're gonna change this a bit uh, There's a bridge here just to make it look cool. It's a double track so we can always go in separate directions after this I think there's just a train leaving There is it's the chirpy line flying chirpy Kind of cool. So lots of things have happened uh, While you were away also this interchange has changed a lot. I've now made this a sunken railroad and this is all going underneath and it's like the trumpet interchange instead of the other one I did, which I didn't like very much. This one, I think I'm going to change it, but I don't know in what I'm going to change it, so we're going to leave it like that for now. Uh, here nothing has changed, only thing that has changed are the subways, the metro, however you want to call it. Uh, I made two lines out of one, we now have the metropolitan line, which is the green one. I, I called it that because this is the Metropolitan uh, University and it crosses that, so that's what we called it. And this is the center city line, which is blue. And we're gonna change both of these because we're gonna work on this area right here. In this little space, you think, well, how can you fit an entire episode in that little space? That's why, because we're gonna make a train station. So I ho hope you uh, you like that. And, uh, and yeah, I downloaded a couple train stations. I did download some cool ones. I don't know what this is, but uh, we're not going to use this one. Uh, I'm going to use this one. It's not a big building like this. Uh, I don't like this one very much. It, it, it is kind of cool, to be very honest. It's kind of nice. It's placed right here. And it has a subway connection, which is all very useful. And it looks nice, with all that stuff. But it's just a bit too big, to be very honest. You got these, these two are... I don't need them. There should be like some sort of an addition which you can put next to it, but it isn't. So that means there's now, what is it, 8 train tracks? Yeah, and 8 is just a bit too many for me. Uh, I don't have that low, much of space. But that's why we're going to use this one. And uh, let's, let's place two down here. As you can see, they're kind of small, so we're going to expand them to this area. But uh, they look very nice. I like the looks of them. Uh, they look a bit modern and uh, and they look clean and that's important because that's what you want in a train station so we're gonna put this one here and here and connect the uh, train line up with this kind of rail very cool 
We can all make this in the same direction. In one direction. And now to detail it a bit further. I have tried something off screen. And I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to place another one right in the middle of these two. So it looks like there's like this massive platform. But it's just three separate ones. Uh, well, which looks cool. I like it. We can always do more detail work uh, on it if we don't like it that much. But for now, I think this will work and will uh, relieve some traffic of the highways and the city lines and all that kind of stuff. Now, we need to connect this up, of course. That's where we're going to use this train track. If you wonder why I got these arrows in there, I downloaded a couple mods which allows me to have more train tracks. I think that's what it's called. And here you can see a couple, you got a one way, you got a one two way on, on single track and you got a double one way. Uh, we're not going to use those. Uh, maybe we're going to use this one, but I'm not really sure of that yet. Oh, I forgot to do something. Um, damn. Go back to this. At the beginning there is this train track. I need this to connect them up. I just I want a double train track going out, or four train tracks that is, to be precise. But yeah, let's see. We're gonna make some sort of a. Like that maybe. And have this come out a bit further. Maybe like this. go out a bit further if we want to or like that kind of cool so let's grab the single train track which I want to do something with I just want to make this this area a bit filled in so let's go for a straight one Something like that, I don't know, I like it. Tried this before off screen and uh, it looked kinda cool. So I'm gonna use this, uh, I don't know if you like it or not. If you don't like it, tough luck. I, uh, I hope you find your luck somewhere else on train tracks. But I think this will work. We can always make it look a bit more realistic if we want to. Uh, which I think we're gonna do with this one. Let's, uh, let's, let's try something here. If we scroll all the way back. We're gonna find. It's gonna go straight out. Like this, maybe. Now, that's what I don't like when it connects up like that, in like some sort of a weird turn kind of thing. I don't like it. Something like this, maybe. Looks a bit realistic. A bit more realistic. And uh, the trains are not gonna go out in this way. Why, you may wonder. Well, don't need it. We got another train track right here. We can always make something go around. And uh, and we can always... If it, it if it, it's really necessary... I'm sorry. I I'm, I'm, didn't talk English that much this week. Uh, we can always delete this building here. And we can make a couple train tracks go in that direction. If we really wanted to. But I'm not going to yet. So far. Now here I want to make some sort of a train yard, so we need to get a couple real things in here. Connect them up like that. Not like that. We always need a place where we can store our trains, that's what we're making now. I don't know how much we need, to be honest, but I'm gonna guess something like this maybe. This one can continue, and I think I'm going to connect this one up. Let's see how we're going to do this. Something like that, and then these also have to connect up to each other. 
But how is the question? Okay, that will work. Barely, but it will work. Don't worry about it. Something like this. I think that will work as a train yard. We can have some cu a couple buildings in here if we really wanted to. Uh, we don't need this. We don't need you road anymore. That was just to... Uh, to figure out if it was 90 degrees straight. Uh, but yeah, this works. I like it. Now, these rail yards, of course, have to connect up to something. Uh, I don't know what. But we're going to figure something out right here. So we got them two connected up right now and we only have one exit. So probably going to be connected up to that one if we can find the exit for this two. And what I think I'm going to do for now is I'm going to just continue this to all the way here. So we can always find a spot where we can exit the city. And uh, I think this was going to be some sort of the projects area where we can have a couple uh, taller buildings here. Uh, but I don't know what I'm going to do with it now once we have the train station here. It's just really... Uh, I don't know. Can we... The question to be is if we can... It doesn't look that derp, is it? It does. Damn, that's bad. But yeah, nothing we can do about it. We can, of course, make train lines. I'm not going to do it today. Uh, that's going to be for a different date. And we're going to make some metro lines right here. Just to make the public transport in this area the best. Uh, also, we're going to make a bus station right here. I think this is going to be like the public transport place. Uh, so, it's going to be a bus terminal here or here. I'm not too sure on which one. And going to be a couple metro lines entering this position. Or this this block right here. Now, I want to make these, uh, these useful. So, we're going to grab a couple trains. Which are probably all the way at the back. But uh, we're going to figure that out. I don't know if I have passenger trains. Oh, there's one here. Probably don't have passenger trains, which is a bit shitty. Sorry, my language. Uh, but I'm going to try and download a couple if I can find them on the Steam Workshop. What's this? That's all sim real. I think we're going to dedicate one, like, one track to all, like, locomotives. Put one here. Another one right behind that one. Which is a sim rail, and then we have this one, which is more sim rail. I want this one here. I just want a couple on here, just to make it look cool. A couple of green ones and and blue one. I think we have more of these kind of guys, so I'm gonna just try and find them real quick. There's another one here. More sim rail, probably. Let's try this one here. So we got a couple in there. And then let's try if we can... Try some find some trailers. My English is really not on point. Tramlink. Cool. It's like the signs of the uh, the London Underground and all that kind of stuff. The buses. Here's another one. Put you down right here. And here. And another one. Right here. White car container prop. I'm gonna try if this works. Let's see. Oh no, we cannot do it. Because of the... If we press this, does it work? No, this mod is not that good. It doesn't interfere with the... Um, with the... Uh, or it interferes with the kind of things. With the rails and all that kind of stuff. Even though I have prop anarchy off. If we can try this. Force zoning, doesn't work, nope. Press Ctrl A, nope, doesn't work. D 
Damn, it doesn't work. So, we're gonna have to do them individually. Which sucks, I know. Probably gonna be a time lapse. But uh, I'm gonna get some trailers in this area and I'm gonna see you after the time lapse. Because it's kind of boring to watch in, uh, in full speed. So, be right back with ya. Okay, so that's done. That took me about uh, 10 minutes to do, just for these kind of trailers for trains. We got one train departing here, which is the uh, the Colossal Systems, a brown train with a couple containers on the back. I like it. Lots and lots of color in these two uh, two areas. We got a, a couple special train. We got some Aurora fuel, I believe that is some shell fuel, whatever that is. A couple more. Some BP fuel, we're sorry, and this one, which is just a couple uh, cool looking things. I like it, looks kind of cool. Real yard complete, not really, we still need to, uh, to detail it a bit more, which we're going to do with this tool, which is, I think, the, uh, the gravel tool, the brush, the sand brush, I'm going to call it for that right now gonna fill everything in here to make it look kind of cool and realistic because that's what you usually see in, in these train yards I believe you usually see gravel everywhere and some more right here like make it a bit sloppy because these people who work here are not really that interested in making it look nice I believe you might be, if you work there and you like making it look nice, then I'm sorry. But that's not in my mind what you do. If that makes any sense. Okay, so we got that going. Uh, that's going to be, of course, detailed in the future. Let's see if we can do something here. What you usually see... Oh, we need these, maybe. Do we need them? I think we do. So, let's just put a couple on couple of these down one here maybe one here yeah just just two of them because it's not it's not really that industrial over here I might change this in the future if I have some passenger trains I probably will change these kind of cargo things in passenger trains but for now I'm gonna leave it like this I'm gonna see what happens See if we have some more things we can put down here. I don't think we do, to be very honest with you. Let's go back here to the train station. I'm gonna create some sort of a, uh, like the subway. We also need a metro here. So let's lead to that for now. Let's get rid of these roads. I want this dedicated 
public transport, you can go. I don't want you here. That was the blue line, and now it's gone. So we're gonna use a couple of these gray stations. I like the look of them, and uh, these are some. What else? So we got one, two, three, four, five, I believe. Five. That's a bit too much, isn't it? I think we can use this one. What is this? This has so much. The blue line is annoying me. I'm gonna delete it. I'm gonna delete it. Via stadium. Yes, go by. We don't need you anymore now. So, let's put this down here, maybe? Or here? Here might be good. We're gonna need a couple stations here, so I'm just trying to figure everything out for now. You're gonna go here on the corner. Then have maybe this one here. We can have a couple lines. Oh, that's already three lines which stop there. Might be a bit too much if we have four lines stopping here. That doesn't fit exactly, which is bad. Not what I wanted to. This fits. Then again, we're going to have a lot of lines stop in here, which we don't want to. You, we need you. We're going to have two stops here. One for another line like that, and just two there stop in there. Okay, so let's connect these two up real quick. Because this is going up though. This stays on the same level. And then let's see where these guys are going. Wow, look at that, uh, like the colors here, the, the white ones. Cool. Now, the subway is going to be a whole different thing than what it is right now. This is going to be entirely changed. Uh, but these two work now. I'm just all over the place in this episode. I hope you don't mind, but we're doing a lot of stuff here. Let's get back to the detailing thing. And let's figure this out here with more gravel. I'm trying to uh, finish this up as much as I can. Something like this. And then I do have a couple bu buildings in this uh, area, in this category for trains. I have some things, which is the station building, if we can place this somewhere. Let's see. Put this here. Can't we? Yes, we can. No, no, no. I'm gonna move you to here. Damn. I'm gonna move you to here then. But that up works. So I don't know what you're doing there. I, I have no idea. Don't uh, I don't know much about trains. That's gonna be a bit of a tight fit there. So let's just turn this one around. Let's see. I'm gonna switch this one around like that and put one down here. Get two of them. Two office kind of buildings. I'm just making it look cool. Let's see if we have something else. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's a cargo terminal, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So, we don't use those. I got more of this uh, these cargo things. So, okay, we got this going. Uh, these are probably going to be changed to passenger trains soon. 
Uh, what can you do in, in an area like this? I don't know. I have no idea. Very honest. Let's make this nice. Or, well, not nice. That's what I meant to do. So, got this train line. If we can find it somewhere, that will be useful. Like so. Okay, so we now have a train stop in here. I don't know for what, but we'll see. What is this? What is that building? I don't. I have no idea. If it's in the description of it, let's check. So, oh, that's a train. Oh, we have a cargo loading station. We can use that. We can use this one. Oh, that's the wrong way around. Oops. Okay, so we have a couple buildings in here now. Starting to look like something. And let's get a road maybe in this uh, this area. I want that to be perfect. So probably around right here. No. Nope. About here. And that road, I don't want that. I want this one. It's a bit smaller than uh, than we have now. Cool. Maybe have this go here and then have a couple parking lots in there, maybe. Let's try. I don't know, what is this? Containers, construction site, huge city park, small city park. But it's a park. Uh, damn it. Pay attention, pay attention. We need a parking lot. Small town football. City parking. Four by four. No, that's. That's, it is more industrial. Let's use this one for now. Oh, that's a different one. Let's move them one over. And uh, improve them. Let's go with, say, fence. We need a fence, don't we? Yeah, I think that's in the industrial thing. Right here. That's the fence they used, so... Let's use this one as well. I know it's not perfect. It doesn't need to be perfect. It needs to look nice. Alright, that works as an industrial parking lot. It's starting to look like something at least. Which is good, it's good. Get some of that concrete in here. Then at the gravel a bit more. Like this. Concrete can go here as well. Alright. So, concrete is in here. Let's get you like that. And this one like that, maybe. Can fix this real quick. Cool. So it's uh, it's looking like a train station at least. That's uh, that's the main thing. If it works, I have no idea. I'm just uh, I'm I'm trying stuff here. I think in the next episode, what we will do is we are gonna make a bus stop, like this main bus station. I think we have a couple of those. I got uh, that looks bad. That one we shouldn't use it. We're going to have like this building over here. A bit of an industrial zoning in the middle of the city. That's what we're going to use this one for. We can also do the bus terminal in here. Might be a bit better. Uh, we'll see. I'm going to try to improve this area to make it uh, passenger trains only. And not as much cargo. 
And, uh, and yeah, that's it. I'm gonna try some more prop trains if we have them. We do have them somewhere. What's this? It's a plane. I don't think that works. To be very honest with you. This, uh, this menu is a mess. Oh, we have this one. Train. Does it work? Train. Does it work? I hope it does. Didn't work. Nope. Oh, we might be able to use this one. Like a prop on there. I'm just uh, getting off topic here. Trying to find trains. There's one. But I want the other ones. Which look a bit faster, actually. They look a bit more like... No, not that one. It's the other one. This. Looks a bit more like a, uh, a passenger train or something. But uh, that's what I'm going to download right now. Passenger trains. And uh, I'm going to hope to make this look nice. Don't pay attention to these two, uh, by the way. With the, uh, they are there because of the middle train station. It's not connected up to, uh, to anything. What we can do, I don't know if it works. I gotta scroll back all the way. The problem with the scrolling is not you have to do it, but my scroll button on this scroll button, uh, the the scroll button on this keyboard is broken, or on this uh, what do you call it? Mouse is broken. Scrolling down is perfect, goes perfect. But scrolling up doesn't work. It it clicks every time. So if you click in a menu like this. And sometimes it pops out and will, wants to place a prop. Now it doesn't do it. Of course, when, you want, when I want to try and show it, it doesn't do it. But it's getting annoying, so I have to probably get a new mouse. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode where we uh, we did actually we did something. Unless, of course, uh, yeah. Well, I know it doesn't matter. We did something this episode. That's what we're gonna uh, we're gonna call it. Uh, we made progress. Probably next episode, as I said, we're going to work on the bus terminal and some metro lines and we're going to make the public transport in the city work. So we're going to focus on bus lines, on metro lines and everything. I'm going to delete them off screen right now and I'm going to try and figure something out and I'm going to see you in the next one, of course. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. If you didn't enjoy, you can always leave a dislike. The button is there for a reason, as I like to say. And I hope to see you in the next one, of course. Take care, you're awesome and bye bye.